Here's how to beat Hua Zhong properly without cheesing him. First step is to get all the flags in the map except for the one he's guarding. I have a guide on how to get the flags in the right order which I'll link in the description. What I'm doing right now is I'm running along the top taking out the dudes on the ballistas. You don't need to do this at all but they can shoot at you while you're near the boss which can add extra stuff to think about so I'm clearing them to save myself having to think about that. And if you're interested I have another video on how to do what I just did but use the ballistas instead to kill the boss without even having to fight him. I'll link that in the description too. From here I'm going to run back to the flag that's directly above the boss so you can get your bearings again. Okay, this is the second last flag to get. The last flag is behind the boss fight. The good news is, even if you don't use the ballista method, this fight isn't too difficult at all, mainly because the boss is pretty susceptible to weapon switch counter attacks. If you didn't clear the ballistas, they can shoot you while you're standing here. Anyway, just wait for the boss to walk all the way back, buff up with whatever you want, then you can get a fatal strike on him right from the start. After that all you have to do is hold guard and shift 2 at the same time which is L1 and R1 on PlayStation. So basically hold left bumper and right bumper together at the same time and wait for the boss to attack. If you press deflect when the boss attacks you'll do a weapon switching counter attack. He got me there but as long as you keep holding guard and R1 when you press deflect it'll be okay. So face off with L1 and R1 both held down. You can let him hit you once and then press deflect to get a counter. Basically never let go of L1 and R1, stand still and press deflect. It can also help to let him hit you once and press deflect straight after for his second swing. There's also plenty of time to heal up during this fight. Basically this is a simultaneous offense and defense approach. It looks like you have to be a deflect master but this boss is pretty easy to deflect and even when you miss time it there's plenty of margin for error so long as you keep your L1 and R1 buttons held down. Again you can always wait and let his first swing hit your guard and then press deflect for the second swing if you're having trouble with timing. This whole time all I've done is hold guard in R1 and press deflect even spamming it at times without moving at all. I got hit there, sometimes it doesn't work sure but it does work more often than not and that's really what matters. The only other thing I should say is when he does his spinning red crit attack and you deflect it he usually follows up immediately with a second one so keep that in mind. Apart from that, all of his attacks can be deflected at the last moment. And if you're really struggling, do the ballista method instead. A link's in the description for that. Anyway, that's it. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.